I have to have two more quarts of transmission fluid in my transmission. No, you don't. Well, yeah, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Well, I'll get better gas mileage. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. Well, I'll have better gear selections and it'll be smoother. Well, no, you won't. Yeah, I will. Okay, so what the heck is the answer? Hey, hello, how are you? And welcome to Road Odyssey. I am Burke. Please subscribe. I really do appreciate it. And thank you to all of y'all who have subscribed. Y'all are fantastic. So, do you or do you not add fluid to your transmission? The two-quart question has been still bubbling up since early 2020. So, I've gone back, done my research, found all kinds of stuff from the past, and stuff from the present. So let's just look into it. Here we go. Let's just cut to the chase. If you're a normal user, that includes spirited driving and maybe a little bit of autocrossing. Not a lot, but a little bit. Do what you want. You can kind of go in between and add one quart. You can be bold, add two quarts, or you can just do nothing and not worry about it. Now, if you're a track user, going out to track days, really hitting those G's a lot, well, add the two quarts you're supposed to. This is the answer. Nothing to complicate this. GM also says it isn't necessary to remove the extra fluid after the track day is over. There's no denying two quarts needed for track use. The reason why you need the two extra quarts for track use only is when you think about this, in normal driving there is not a high lateral G load on the car which makes that transmission oil, you might say, slosh and you need the two extra quarts so that there is plenty of fluid in that transmission and it helps to control the temperatures as well. Like I said, this has been around since early 2020. We went out to the Corvette forums, found stuff there, uh, mid-engine Corvette forum as well. They had several articles and they were all very good. And even went out, found this Tremec manual uh, it had interesting information in it. So that was where some of my information has come from. For track use, you've got to add the two quarts. If you're not out on the track, don't worry about it. Let's see what Rick Conti had to say about this. I've already admitted to you guys in this vlog, we are going to talk more about this, about whether you should add the additional two quarts or not. And I did it more discussions to come. The right answer to that question is, especially non-Z51, non-track situation. Well, according to General Motors, you only need the two two quarts if you're going to track the car. Correct. That's their standard. Uh, whether right. you put it in or not is entirely up to you. So right now, I would say just keep doing what you're doing. You're not hurting anything. Advised right from Chevrolet, only put those in if you have a Z51 and if you're in a track situation, which doing launch control is not a track situation. You're not out doing competitive driving. You're not going through different elevations and all that. So right now you're fine. GM gives four decent reasons why they do not add the two extra quarts. Number one, reduce overall mass. Number two, fluid cost saves GM money. Number three, Transmission spin losses for the majority of the customers that do not track their car. Number four, a slight improvement in fuel economy. These four answers to me just boil down to GM and Tremec saving money. 
I don't think it would be that hard for Tremec to add two more quarts if they really wanted to. On the other hand, if Tremec really thought that the two extra quarts were needed, they probably would put it in there just so that they wouldn't have any issues in the future. Historically, the C7 Corvette came with two quarts less of fluid also. Let me summarize this very old quote from early 2020 by Taj himself. We are trying to keep the Corvette as affordable as possible. There you have it. That's what it's all about. Nothing more. Just saving a nickel and dime here and there to keep the cost of the Corvette as low as possible. All right. To me, this ought to answer the question of adding or not adding the two quarts or one quart or a half a quart or whatever. So, you know what? Relax. Take it easy. And I'll see you later. Bye.